be a lot different than your V6. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We all have that friend or know that one guy that thinks his V6 Mustang is the coolest thing. So meet Sam, one of my good buddies that drives a V6 Mustang. All right, whenever you're ready. Whenever you're ready. So we're gonna get a five-year-old's reaction of a V6 Mustang. Are you ready to hear this, watch this? Yeah. You excited? All right, bud, press play.
here, there was this this uh, old grandma on a Porsche box or whatever. She was doing like barely 40 through here, or really? through through the corners and everything. And it was just ridiculous. Her her grandson or whoever was with her kept looking behind him, to or kept looking behind him, look at my car, because they could hear me from a mile away. That bike just turned around. Now he's coming towards us. Huh. probably been right at maybe 10 15. see the thing that i do like about my v6 is because the exhaust setup so many people can't tell the difference when i'm just cruising around really if really slow GT. yeah they, they just can't tell and then the other thing is because it's so much lighter on the front end it slides so beautifully it's so graceful doing doing uh what is it drift circles stuff like that drifting it around it just glides around really easily. The suspension's a little floaty though. I need to get some better coilovers. Can you tell what's behind that truck? It's a Honda. Or a Nissan. Oh, that's a Pontiac. enough v6 content for one vlog before everyone gets all bent out of shape i do not hate on the v6 i respect everyone's build we all have the same passion so i just wanted to make that clear because some people get really bent out of shape and be like oh jd hates the v6s i really don't because i've actually seen a lot of v6 mustangs out there built super nice and didn't even know that they were v6s so those of you that have been on this channel and that know me pretty well, you guys know that I've had a variety of cars. And I've had some cars in the past that I am not too proud of saying that I've owned. So I really have no room to talk. I just wanted to definitely make that clear. And I think a lot of us have had cars in the past that we are probably not too happy about. But anyways, that's besides the point. I just like giving Sam a hard time. He's a really good buddy of mine. and. That's what friends do when they get around each other is they just rag on each other and just give each other a hard time. So hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any V6 bodies, share this with them. Oh, I forgot to mention. So I'm gonna, Sam, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna take the credit for this. He's actually shopping for a GT500 now. He is actually going from a V6 Mustang to a GT500. So Sam is actually in the market for a GT500 as of now. I don't know when he's planning on getting one. He said in the next few months or so, but he is in the market for a GT500. So that's gonna be a big leap going from, yeah. Um, so don't make a meme out of yourself. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this content. Hit the like button, subscribe, and if you're new to the channel, this is my GT500 and Laura's Cobra over there and the Corvette in the background. I don't know if you guys can see it. That's Tom's Corvette. Laura and I actually just use this for date night. That is the motorhome we do videos with that. I've got a complete playlist for RV vlogs, so we do stuff with the RV as well. I'm going to go ahead, wrap this up, and if you made it this far in the video, hit the like button, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Here's a little sneak peek of what we got coming. I recently visited my buddy Kevin and he has two cars that you guys may recognize. One being the Bandit and the other being Kit from the show Knight Rider. And if you guys don't recognize these, you're probably just that young. So the car is having a conversation with me. All right. Are you faster than a- That's a reasonable assumption. <laughs> Are you having a conversation with me? If that's a problem, it would appear to be a self-solving problem. Dude. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's weird that you can have a conversation with this car. I believe the word is sucker. This. <laughs> Are you faster than a Mustang? 
I can easily outperform those. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> really? I can serve you better if I'm familiar with your strategy. This is going to be a very interesting video. I certainly hope so.